Hey Cowboys Nation! If you don't want to miss any first-hand news from America's team, subscribe to the channel now, as we are always attentive to the latest news from the Dallas Cowboys and here you will always be in the know with. The real-life Cowboy barely got a chance to saddle up with America's team. Now he's already leaving the ranch. Wide receiver James Washington is being cut by the Cowboys, as per a Wednesday tweet from NFL insider Ian Rapoport, who cited a source. The 26-year-old was signed in March and was expected to play a large role in the Dallas passing attack this season after the Amari Cooper trade. But a training camp foot fracture landed him on injured reserve to start the season, he was not made active until December 10. He made his 2022 debut in the team's Week 14 game versus Houston and also played in the Week 15 loss to Jacksonville. He had been a healthy scratch the past two games. Washington played a total of 15 snaps for the Cowboys. He did not record a catch and was not targeted with a pass. Already leave your like in this video, so you don't miss the latest Cowboy news we posted here. Thank you very much. The 2018 second round draft pick and Texas native spent his first four pro seasons in Pittsburgh after an All-American career as an Oklahoma State Cowboy. After signing a one-year deal with his favorite childhood team, Washington missed his first media call with Cowboys reporters, because an unexpected delivery of hay showed up at his 40-acre ranch near Abilene. Although the endlessly rumored Cowboys Odell Beckham Jr. partnership has not come to fruition, the team added Hilton in December. The 11th-year veteran has emerged early in his Dallas tenure, catching five passes, one on a third and 30 to help the Cowboys pass the Eagles, for 102 yards in his first two games. The third leading receiver in Colts history, Hilton has fit in alongside CeeDee Lamb and Michael Gallup. It looks like that setup will continue into the postseason, with Beckham still a free agent and Washington headed to the wire. Chosen 60th overall in 2018, Washington did not catch on in Pittsburgh the way many day two receivers have over the past several years. Following a 735-yard 2019 season spent mostly catching passes from ex-Oklahoma State teammate Mason Rudolph, Washington saw his playing time diminish. The Steelers selected Chase Claypool in the second round of the 2020 draft and bumped him ahead of Washington later that year. Even as Juju Smith-Schuster missed most of the 2021 season, Washington was unable to carve out a major role. He caught 24 passes for 285 yards last season. Dallas made Washington and Jalen Tolbert its top two outside receiver investments this offseason. Tolbert has two receptions thus far. In addition to Hilton, sixth-year cowboy Noah Brown has stepped in as a tertiary target for the team. Brown's 545 receiving yards sit second among Cowboys this season. Hey Cowboys fan, in your opinion, James Washington was a bad hiring for the Cowboys or not? What's your opinion? Put it in the comments because it's very important for the Dallas Cowboys. Stay tuned because at any time I update you on the latest Cowboys news.